Thanks, Dave. You may have been hearing a bit more sniffling and sneezing lately. Medical professionals say that's because there's colds and sinus infections going around right now. CBS 3's Peter Kevakowski gets heard from local health experts about why so many people are getting sick right now and how to know when you should get tested for COVID. As COVID guidelines loosen and the masks come off, many are noticing the rebound of the common cold. That includes Karen Metermeyer, an advanced practice registered nurse for Essentia Health. So we had a long stretch where I wasn't seeing, um, say, sinus infections. Um, and as masks have started to come off uh, out in public, I'm starting to see more respiratory stuff. Metermeyer says this is not a coincidence. She says as people start to go out once again, they're being exposed to more germs than during the height of the pandemic. Um, I don't think our immune systems have gone to sleep during the time that we had masks on. I think we just managed to dodge a lot of germs for a while and we're not dodging them quite so well anymore. Amy Westbrook, the St. Louis County Public Health Division Director, says since cold and sinus infection symptoms are sometimes similar to that of COVID-19, it is crucial to be tested for COVID even if you have been fully vaccinated. Certainly go in and get tested if you're feeling sick, if you have fever, uh, chills, short, shortness of breath, those are runny nose, um, those are all symptoms of COVID, but we know that they're also symptoms of the common cold. As for how to prevent the cold and sinus infection currently circulating, Metermeyer says precautions haven't changed. Wash your hands, please, please, please. Wash them early and often and for a nice long time. Um, try to keep your germs to yourself. So um, if you're coughing, sneezing, cover. All in an effort to keep you safe and healthy this summer. Both Westbrook and Metermeyer stress the importance of getting tested for COVID to help keep everyone safe.